Following the COVID-19 pandemic, bus drivers are in short supply. Dan Redford, a first student of Helena, said that this is about as bad of a shortage as he's ever seen. And in order to carry out their routes effectively, they need more bus drivers, which is why they're hosting this event called Big Bus, No Big Deal, where they're asking the public to come out, give it a shot, drive the bus, and show them it's no big deal. This event is to actually show them that it's not a big deal. Um, the bus, once you get up and get in the seat where you sit up high, we have the trainers that are going to ride with them and show them that, they're, uh, that it's not, not hard to drive a school bus. It's actually pretty easy. Redford noted the hours aren't exactly full time with most drivers picking up about 20 hours a week. But for someone who just needs or wants those hours, it could be a perffect fit. It's great for retirees for supplementing their income. It's also very, very good for single parents or parents that stay or at home parents, I should say. If your child's over one years old, you can bring them with you on the bus. So while I may not be a retiree or a stay at home parent, I figured I'd give it a shot and see if driving a bus was a challenge. Put your foot on the brake, good. All right, now you're starting to feel the sense of the size of this. Mm -hmm. Got it turns, so we're going to miss that cone with the front end. Let's just say I didn't miss that cone. But Redford noted the drivers go through a training process where they can get super comfortable driving a school bus. And the added benefit to that? Being a part of the community. You get to help out the community. You know, um, driving school bus is very rewarding. You get to know these kids. You get to become almost calling them your kids. I have lots of drivers that go, hey, I don't want to I don't want to change routes because these are my kids. For more information on how to become a bus driver here in Helena or even around the area, you can find that online on our website. Reporting in Helena, Sam Hoyle, MTN News.